a fashion show with a twist. The Dunedin Town Hall is playing host to the annual Cabri Couture Fashion Show as part of the city's chocolate carnival. Event manager Kylie Rufiu Karawana says the event is about focusing on creativity within fashion, with this year's theme celebrating national fashions at play. But while the emphasis is on fun, it takes plenty of preparation to get the looks sorted. That process starts in May, so it's a couple of months before the actual event, and they don't have a lot of time. It sounds like two months, oh, they've got plenty of time to put things together. It's really not, not when they have to start from scratch and start thinking about the theme. The designers not only got the chance to show off their hard work on the runway, they also helped contribute to a worthy cause, with the money raised from the fashion show going to the Otago Youth Adventure Trust. We've chosen this charity because it's, it's, it resonates with our sporting theme. They're a charity that does so much for our, our youth and our communities. They put together the programs and maintain the facilities of the camps that all of the schools in Dunedin use. So I think it was just an appropriate and worthwhile charity and I know that quite often they, they, they are always looking for help. Kathleen Ring took out the top spot with her entry titled Little Indian. While it wasn't her first time taking part in the Couture Show, she says she was intimidated by the level of competition this time around. My husband sent me a text but before the judging and he's like, are you going to do it next year? I said, no, I think I'll give next year a miss because I was a bit disappointed. But now I'm not disappointed, obviously, so maybe, yeah, I think definitely probably try again next year. It took a team of over 30 people two days to prepare for the event, which overall brought in just over $12,500. Jack Conroy, 39 Dunedin News.